Hi, I'm Sergio from Hornet Plugins. Today we want to introduce you our latest plugin, the LU Meter. The LU Meter is a quick and handy uh, meter that can be used to evaluate the loudness of a single track or a complete mix. It's not a Nibu R128 R meter because it only considers the momentary loudness and uh, both left and right channels. But it still can be useful because uh, it uh, really gives you an insight on the loudness of your tracks. This meter uses the same K filter that is uh, um, in the front of uh, standard loudness unit meters and uh, it uses the same 400 milliseconds integration time of the momentary meters. With this you can stick it on uh, single tracks or your complete master, a complete main mix and you can have a look to how much the meter, uh, the loudness of your uh, track is. And it's a relative meter, so the zero point can be set to whatever you like. By default, it's set to 23 uh, loudness, units full, loudness, uh, u loudness units full scale. Sorry. And let's jump into the guy so we can see what every single function does. On the, on the main part, you have the two meters, left and right, and the scale. Uh, it's the same uh, scale and the same methods you can find on our VU meter. In fact, this plugin is derived uh, uh, from that plugin and our ELM128 meter. Then you have the gain section, that is uh, the, the core of this plugin, uh, where you can set the desired uh, level of loudness you want to reach by default is set to 0 LU the maximum peak protection and that actually makes so that uh, no signal can be higher than the level you choose here it can be disabled if you want to uh, go above 0 dB the gain knob that can be used to set the gain and it's automatically set by the auto button here. Then you have uh, the grouping feature that is found uh, also on the view meter that uh, allows you to set uh, many instances of the, this plugin to one group and uh, spread the gain or meter settings to every instance of the plugin. To do that you have to trigger the specific button before enabling this gain button every plugin on group 1 will receive the settings specified here then you can set the reference of the zero point here it's by default a 23 minus 23 loudness units and the color of the matter clicking on the, this box pop-ups a uh, color wheel that you can wear from where you can choose the color of the matter Let's see it in action. Oh, hey! As you can see, it's a simple matter with peak hold, but the magic comes in when you uh, enable the auto gain. Enabling the auto gain makes so that this knob is automatically adjusted uh, to reach the level specified here. So when I press play now, the level will be adjusted and uh, the signal will peak at the uh, zero loudness unit. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. It worked its magic and uh, set uh, the gain to minus uh, 13 dB. So we can be sure that the level peaks at zero uh, LU or in this case minus 23. Uh, loudness units full scale. If we want to use it on uh, um, submixes or single tracks, we can now just copy the plugin, put it in another track. Settings are kept. We can trigger the gain for the group one. And now change. Uh, 
activating the out again, we will activate it to hold the group. So everything will be recalculated once again. So we have calculated this gain too. It's for another track, it's different. This is the same as before. And we with a single with a single click we can <coughs> adjust the gain of the whole group of plugins. This uh, speed up the workflow uh, dramatically. As you can understand, imagine having uh, 10, 12, and 24 tracks and uh, adjusting the gain uh, just with the press of a button. So, this matter is available on www.hornetplugins.com. You can go there, uh, download it, and uh, let us know what you think about it. We don't provide a demo for this plugin because it's a simple matter but we provide a 15 days 100% money back guarantee so you can try it and if you don't like it we give you the money back thank you very much for watching